Now, to those of you who do not know, uh, best way I can explain what the hell they're doing, it's practically like the whole Make-A-Wish Foundation, but it's for dying patients who are close to fucking death. Like, mere hours or days close to death. That's why they go in their brain and initiate, like, making it feel like they've lived that life that they've always wanted. That's pretty much the best way I could summarize it if you guys still do not understand. But, yeah. This one, it's not as crazy as Finding Paradise, how it was all weird and shit. This one is straightforward, pretty much. So this should be easier to understand. I hope. I'm sorry if it's still confusing. It's just a game. <laughs> hmm. This should be the last accessible memory. Disable speech of all except Johnny. Done. Let's get him. At any time, you can view your position in time by moving the mouse toward the top of the screen. Yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know. God damn, why do they move so fast? Like, look at that. They're just. I'm, like, I'm not even pressing a button, it's just me moving. Like, I know where to go now, at least, so. I've seen this game played many times. It's so great. It is really a great game. It's just. <gasps> Music, sorry. Johnny. Ah, Johnny. Mm. Oh. What a pleasant surprise. Uh, we don't get many visitors around here. Um, my name is Dr. Eva Rosaline, and this is... Dr. Van Matahan. Dr. Lorenzo Van Matahan. <laughs> Dr. Neil Watts. Uh. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from the agency? <laughs> How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Oh, uh, Lily, get us some tea, please. Uh, uh, Lily? Actually, uh, you've already called us. Huh. Uh. Oh. We're here to fulfill our contract form the relative future, or from the relative future. Uh. Careful there, if you slip off the cliff, we're gonna have to reload this memory. Watch it, Neil, show some respect. Uh, it's just the program, you know. I know, but this is his last accessible memory. We need its cooperation. Worst come to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you waste time like that? You, uh, uh, you are here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Uh, yes, John. Oh, I suppose I had a good run. <laughs> well, not a good enough, it seems. So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? We can't, but you might be able to. This is why it's easier to understand, because this little segment right here. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. Hmm? It's fine, you can tell us. It's essential for helping us to get you to go there. You want the fame? The money? You've got to have a motive. I'm sorry, but I... I really don't know. I just... do. I'm not gonna tell it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Uh, nevertheless, Johnny, here's what we... Uh, here's what we will do. I was gonna say will. We need to get to your childhood, but it is too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to traverse through your memories with gradual backwards leaps. 
which you've given us the permission to do in the relative future. Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for dis uh, direct access, we will return here. That's when you'll need to help us influence childhood you to, became, uh, to become an astronaut. Or to get a giant catapult. <laughs> the point is, you'll need to have more to say than just, I don't know. Uh, as long as you can take me to the moon, I will cooperate in any way possible. Good. Now, in order to lead to a memory, uh, we need an item that is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? Um... That'll do. Well, shall we? Ladies first. Okay, now hopefully that clarified what went down in Finding Paradise. That's what their job is. It's practically a Make-A-Wish Foundation, but instead of making the actual wish, like, months before their, like, death comes or before their, like, whatever happens, this is for patients that are surely gonna die and are close to death, like, literally that day, hour, or whatever. That's what these guys are here for. Just wanted to... Because I, I know Finding Paradise was sort of weird to start with, but this one is the best one, in my opinion. Between Finding Paradise and that one. Yes, I cry with Finding Paradise, but I might cry with this one, too. No, Moon. No. We'll need to prepare this memento first. Prepare! Oh, yeah! Now this one's the picture. This is what I hoped the other one was going to do, but it didn't do it. Pick the memento. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought Finding Paradise would be. That little puzzle thing. Because I wanted to, like, to take it, but no. Memento can now be activated for transfer. So, tra traversal. Whatever. Activate. Wait! Uh, what about my privacy? We'll try not to violate what we can avoid. But, in most cases, it can't be helped. Because hmm. I, I already know his whole life, technically. I know. Oh no. I'm already crying because I think I know what time uh, this happened. Turn off visibility and interactive. In, uh, turn off. Visibility and interactivity, it'd be a messy, it'd be messy to be seen. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, happy. Oh, I'm already crying because I already know uh, what time this has happened. Jeez, I got to ask him about the, all these rabbits. This is creeping me out. We probably should have checked his record first, psychopathic first. Oh shit. Wait, uh, what the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. It's probably just a part of his memory. A part of this memory. Then I stand by. And I. Uh, then I stand by my point. Um. Anyway, quit the bat. Uh. <laughs> it's hard to read for some reason. I don't know why. It's. Because I know this is going to hit again, and I hope it fucking does, because dear lord, this thing fucking great! Anyway, quit blabbering. Find a memento here to top from. I don't know which one it is. It's, uh... That. Yeah. Um, I just gotta look at things. Oh yeah, the bunny. Wait, can I use the bunny before I got that thing? Well, aren't you special? Having two colors when all the... Your siblings look like they're drowned by or drowned in bleach. What's that you Wait, what's that? You think you're really creepy? Why yes, I agree. Do it! That counts. The platypus. The platter fucking puss. The puss the pu platter. Fucking hell. Am I gonna go I can't fucking go in there, I guess I gotta go upstairs. One 
is this? A million years old? Guess we'll find out. It was new clothes, whatever. Yeah, that counts. Um, glass bottle of pickled olives. Yeah, I hate this stuff. What's the hate? It's pickled olives. Exactly. Okay. Um. Fresh wild flowers. Well, that counts. Okay, cool. Fucking hell. Don't. If we have to explain our presence to him at every memory, I'd go crazy. Don't tempt me. Yeah, it's him. This is technically him, uh... I think it was a couple years back, this memory was accessible with some shit. Try and get to the fucking platypus, it won't let me. Guess could just click him? I don't know. I know the platypus is one, but it won't fucking let me, I guess, like that, maybe? Unless I can go outside, I can't go outside. A clock, maybe? The clock is moving, but soundless. Oh, okay, it was a clock. I thought it was a platypus. Um, there we go. Ah, Duncan! What the fuck was that? What? That's it. I'm doing the breaking from now on. <laughs> I don't know how she got all pissed from that. Uh, all right, let's see if my um, skills are better now. Yeah! How you do it? Oh, and I beat the overall. Fuck you. <laughs> Activate. Activate. Oh, at least I don't want to do the. Mm. Yep. Right here. When it comes to rain, two is better than on two. I don't mind it, regardless. Seems like these memories hops only span a short period of time. We need to find a leaping memento, or it's going to take forever. Man, yeah, just enjoy the scenery. In memory of River E. Ryle. River E. Ryle. God fuck it. An old stuff toy platypus. Honestly, I just don't think this animal has to has the right to exist. The world's not big enough for two of you. Damn you. <laughs> Damn. Okay. It's finished, River. Like you, I'll uh, be able to watch over her every day. <laughs> yeah. You won't be alone anymore. I might never understand why, but I, I stayed true to your wish. I'm sure, Anya is grateful to you too. But when I'm gone. Who's going to watch over us? Uh, who are you? My name is Eva. Um, I was just passing by. Um, 
Was she your wife? Yes, um, her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. Hmm? She, she didn't need to do it. But she, she didn't. You wouldn't understand. I don't even understand. So I, it, it reminds me of my grandpa. Um, my our grandma died um, first, and he was left alone for I think a lot longer than um, what happened here because he lost her in two years. Um, our grandpa lost her and went on for another couple. It just you know it. Mm, that's what got me. That's what really got me. About time you got here, I almost thought you fell off the cliff. What were you doing? I'm enjoying the scenery. What else? Any luck here? Ah, oh, big luck. Huge dinosauric luck. Huh? This place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse. What do you expect? I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun we breaking the barrier for yourself. We Token Lighthouse, yeah. I didn't think the game was going to do it again. It's actually doing it. It's making me get emotional. She is. River. <laughs> Just enough. After we pay for your operation, uh, we'll have just enough left for it. So don't you worry. White lie. That's what you call it, right? No, I'm sure we can just... Stop it. I don't like it when you lie. I calculated our finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try to convince me against my will? We need the money for you medical bills, River. I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this... This is just too much. I mean, she... She isn't even... You know what makes me happy, Johnny? What? Do you? Well, I do. I just hope you can help me with it. River... When the papers from my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you grant my wish, I want you to use it to finish building that lighthouse. Or oh, that house, my bad. I guess they mean the lighthouse. And then for every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. 
visit her, speak to her, comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. What about you? Happy. I'll be happy. It feels like this was more emotional. Oh my fucking god. Johnny? Yes? I made this. Tell me what it is. What? Just tell me what it is. It's... It's a rabbit, like all the others you made. What else? Um, it's made of paper? What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? Look, River, I, I wrote a song. It's for you. Okay. Well, you like to hear it. Yes. You didn't have to bring the piano in here for uh, this. In here, you're just fine with the door open. It's called Four River. <laughs> Why so cliche? It's uh, just a placeholder. <sighs> Who is this Anya they were talking about? If she's so important, shouldn't we have seen her in his late memories? I guess he didn't keep that promise after all. Unless what? Never mind. Hey, that's the same song the kids were playing earlier, huh? I guess he taught them. You know what? I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on. I already got my memory links. You want to hitch a hike, a quick ride, or look around yourselves? Um, no, I'll stay and explore. Uh, go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. You miss the days when memory audio to MP8 conversions were legal? I think I bought home. I think I brought home over 2,000 songs during my first year on this job. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> yeah, because I want to explore. I don't want to um, just skip all this, you know, because I don't want to just, you know, leave you guys with nothing. Oh, hello. I'm telling you, there's just no way. What if we take it apart? Look at us, John. We aren't exactly on the right page of piano moving. You know what? This means that much to you. I'll pay for the professionals to do this. I can't help saving that house for you, so this is the least I can do. Oh shit, that was two? Holy fuck. Sorry. Glass bottle of pickled olives. Hmm, someone really likes these. Yeah, no shit, right? A pot of mixed dough. I, I am not getting these things on purpose, I swear. Okay, well, let's... Uh, there has to be something in the room, actually. Probably the rabbit again? I don't know. No, the platypus. The fucking platypus. It's the fucking... Ye oh, no, it's the fucking... Book. Not that. Ow. Ha! Kiku! Ha sha! Yeah, Rosaline won't do it, but I will. God damn it. <laughs> okay, hold on. So let me see. Ideal for. Oh, wait, why didn't I just need to.
I don't know what. Oh, fuck. I fucked this thing up. Family came in. They cheated. God damn. What the fuck did I even do wrong? Okay. Hold on, hold on. Maybe. There we go. There you go. That took 20, guys. That took fucking 20. God damn. I hate the family fucking coming in the middle of this shit. Um, give me a sec. I'm gonna fucking lock the door. Okay? Oh, there he goes. Okay. Now we're back. Uh, let's head on out. God damn. My family came in and it sort of ruined a lot of shit. So that's how my overall sucks now. Oh shit. Okay. Well, wow, the music's still going. Hmm. Finally. Oh yeah, I like this. Look at this. Woo! <laughs> I like the hop. Oh. Huh. Looks like we... Oh. Look what we have here. Hmm. The house is barely being built. I bet they saw the cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. Is he the one doing all of it? Nick called and said I should come. Uh, I bought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? Um, I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed in its late stage. Fortunately, it's treatable. But the medical bills... Oh, fuck. We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for her treatment. Uh, I'm just relieved she'll, she'll be okay, but... You don't know how much this place means to her. She's going to be heartbroken. I help, but Ted and I have been barely getting by since the market crashed. Yeah. I don't even know what they're talking about, but yeah. What are you going to do now? I... I'm... I'm going to tell them what we can make it. Oh, that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. I don't want her to do anything crazy. You shouldn't lie to her. I don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she'd choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when you're near out of what you know typicals think you know what's best for others. Hey, when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? Hmm? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from the cliff to bring back to her. It'll at least give her some comfort. That doesn't make 
what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. Oh! He said it's called Everything's Alright. <laughs> oh! oh, I love music boxes. They give me goosebumps. It isn't. 